Hi everyone, Jesse back here um, at the crime scene on how to be pro L.A. Noir. Um, last time we checked, we found dirt, a pipe, and a wallet. Let's see what else we'll find here. He said like a little bit of blood. This is Pulp Fiction's back car kind of shit. Lost a lot of blood. An anime amount of blood, really. Is there anything else in here? The back. This is too much blood for a human being. Oh, did we just check the crunk? Let's see here. Circumstantial. And says that word you said that I know. What's this paper? One live hog. Mr. F. Morgan picked up a live pig yesterday. Who's F. Morgan, and why did they need a pig? So we're gonna go to the pig shop, find out more about this pig. But let's talk to this feller here. How you doing, mate? Sir, I'm Detective Phelps. Name's Nate Wilkie. Nice to meet you. You found the vehicle? Sure. Saw it just sitting there. Mm -hmm. Strange place to be parking your car. It is. Figured it is. I'd better take a look. And then I saw all the blood. So I called the police. Alright. Mind if I ask what you were doing? Probably work here, here, don't you? Well, I work for the railway. I was on my way out to the switch and reckon I'd take a shortcut. Okay. Um, I think that's true. Did you see anybody else in the yard? Maybe somebody hanging around the car? Nope. I hadn't seen a soul all day till you boys turned up. Alright, alright. That's, that's fair, I think. Oh, we did it right, see? Do you know Adrian Black, Mr. Wilkie? Looks like his face. No, sir. That ain't a name I'm familiar with. Hmm. I'm gonna do the intuition with the eye. So we hit the eye button. Let's, let's, let's remove an answer. It's either a truth or a lie, and I don't think it's a lie. You ever seen the car? Yeah. Funny enough, I did. A couple of nights ago, it was over there in the parking lot. Okay. I know most of the cars are parked here regularly, so it kind of stood out. All right. Content the wallet what? by the car. Was there anything in it when you arrived? You accusing me of something, Mister? I don't. I don't. I don't think. I'm doubting what you said there. Do you want the patrolman to hold you down while we turn out your pockets, Mister Wilkie? Yeah. Do you want that, Mister Wilkie? I checked inside that wallet. Not that I was gonna steal anything. Maybe I took a look. All right. But there weren't no money in there. Not even change. Okay. Not so hard to say. Is it? We found a steel pipe with blood on it near the car. You know anything about it, Mr. Wilkie? Yeah. No, sir. I went straight for the law when I saw the car was full of blood. You just told me about the wallet. But I'm gonna think you're truthing it. When you saw the blood, was it wet, bright red, or uh, darker like it is now? Darker, I'd say. Look dry already. Hmm. So it's paint. Thank you for your help, Mr. Wilkie. We'll contact your employer if we need anything more from you. Yeah. If you have to, I guess. I leveled up. I can't really spend no more time over this. Somebody's got to inform the wife, Phelps. You're done here. We'll head over there now. Um, we're going to go to the police, the pig station. And by that, I didn't mean the police station. All right, let's go. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Is this which car is ours? The police one, or is this one? This one's ours? I think this is our car, right? I'm taking this car. Alright. Uh, I guess we have to go to the black residence. I wanted to go to the pig station and figure out who F. Morgan is. 620 Bunker Hill Avenue. You know where that is? Behind Bunker Hill. A couple blocks north Oh, thanks. Station. Thanks, real dick. Real dick over here. What do we tell the wife? We tell her her husband's dick. Play it by the book. There's no stiff yet, so let's see how it plays out. Yeah. We have glasses, though. I'm faking the glasses and took to 11. Oh, did you see that? Could be a car pack gone wrong. Make black. Die! You're gonna kill someone! No one's gonna die from hitting a train. What is this, 1941? No, it's 1946. Make black drive somewhere lonely, then give him a tap. Oh, you're talking about the case. Because he needs the car. Someone got a little heavy hand. Yeah, exactly. Take it easy. You take it easy, new Ralph. How so, genius? Who puts an alley there? Where is Adrian? If you've gone to all the trouble to steal the car, you're wrong. 
You leave the body behind, not the car. Yeah. Got Unless the glasses are the car. What the fuck? Take it easy, Phelps. I'd rather get there in one piece. Oh, uh, it's, it's fine. Yeah, you're gonna need a lot more than a paint job. Your engine's on fire. You should fucking run. Fucking people. Oh, out of the way, man! You don't run. Jeez. driving along and his oil light comes on. Yeah. He stops the car and gets out. He pops the hood and he's on a rail crossing. Huh? No, you got it. He's got his head under there checking the oil. The Southern Pacific freight slams into his car doing 90 miles an hour. That's I've seen that before. Car came to a rest more than a mile down the track. Get out of my way, things. There's a 911. Who needs a second amendment when we give a goddamn fool the license to get behind the wheel of an automobile? Yeah, fools all over with automobile licenses. Is that how my car's. Why leave the victim's ID? If it's a murder, why leave the car? The evidence doesn't add up. Free lesson, folks. Evidence will only get you so far. You ask me? The whole thing feels hinky as hell. What's hinky what mean? I wouldn't give to have your powers of intuition, Counselor. Don't worry, kid. Keep watching the master and you'll get there one day. I was being sarcastic, you jackass. Well, well. Oh, jeez, cops. Alright, here we are. Money one more time and you're a goner. Yeah. Sorry, mister. Just my hands are shaking. Yeah, you got a gun. Shut up! Get the money in the bag! Yes. Yes, sir. He's doing it as best you can, man. Hell up, will you? Come on. Let's do this. It's goddamn cops! Oh, we're not cops, we're just guys with guns. He's got a gun! So do we. Are you just gonna stay behind again? Get out of my way, Jim! I don't like when they run with me. What are we waiting for? Let's see him out run this baby. Is it this car? Probably, because they're driving like a drunk asshole. Yeah! Ooh, I'm down out. Whoa, 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 whoa. What? We got you. Whoa, what's with those tires? He slowed down too soon. Why, his car can just go faster? Can you shoot the tires out, you drunk fuck? What's my partner doing? Enjoying the ride, buddy? Jesus, cops! Here, we're making a break for it on foot. Why am I going out this way? Yeah, take your time. You're under arrest. You shot off my hat. Ooh, that was intense. And by intense, I mean easy. Car 11K to KGPL. Bristol Hotel 211 is code 4. Yeah. Words. We did it. Um, we did it. Um, we got the cop stuff done. Yeah, yeah. Anyways, thanks for watching, everybody. We leveled up. We got new intuition points, which will help us for solving the rest of this case. So stay tuned and find out who did the glasses kidnap and or murder or both. Dun dun dun. Don't forget to subscribe and remember this is our last video for four days. So enjoy what you can. I might have vlogs and an ice bucket challenge up, but that's about it. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed, and um, talk to you later. Ciao.